Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The audit log in QuickBooks Online Plus lets you view all the changes made in your company file and who made them. The audit log shows the 50 most current entries or changes made to your company data per page by default. You can easily see older instances by adjusting the date range in the audit log or clicking the next link in the lower right corner to review older entries on the next pages in the audit log if available. To open the audit log in QuickBooks Online, click the settings button in the QuickBooks Online toolbar. Then click the audit log link under the tools setting in the menu that appears. Alternatively, click the reports link in the navigation bar. If needed, then click the Standard tab to the right to show the standard reports. In the Business Overview Report section on that tab, then click the Audit Log title. To filter the entries in the Audit Log page that opens, select Filtering Choices from the User, Date Changed, or Events dropdowns in the upper left corner of the page. To change the columns and rows in the audit log, click the Settings button in the upper right corner of the list of events to show a drop-down menu. Then check or uncheck the checkboxes under the columns heading in the drop-down menu to show or hide those columns. To set the number of entries to show per page in the audit log, select an option in the Page Size section of the drop-down menu. To print the audit log, Click the Print List button in the upper right corner of the list of events to open a new page or tab with a printer-friendly view of the audit log. Your web browser's print dialog box also opens, letting you easily print the audit log. You can close this new web page or tab when you are done printing it. To view the changes to an event in the audit log, click the View link in the Events History column to view the details of the changes. For transactions, this often opens an audit history page and a transaction history pane at the right side of the window. In either type of page, you can click your browser's Back button to return to the main audit log page after clicking the View link to show the event's details, if desired. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.